now? Hold up. They're still too spread out. And this is gonna be good. Not if they notice us first. Keep your goddamn head down. <laughs> Look at those idiots. They have no idea what's coming. That's the fucking idea. Get your fucking head down. What are we waiting for? They're not even armed. This is gonna be a fucking pinata party. If you're expecting candy, you're in for some disappointment. The candy isn't the fun part. The fun part is seeing it fly everywhere when you whack the shit out of the piñata. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to be too disappointed. Where's the prisoners? I got tired of them moaning. So you let them go? No, I didn't let them go. Motherfucker, we were going to trade them. Oh, well. That's what you're gonna tell Diesel when he asks why you killed them? I didn't kill them. The dogs did. What dogs? I don't know. Some dogs. I didn't ask their fucking names. Oh, but they must have been fucking hungry. Cause damn, once they sniffed blood, it was chow time. You stupid son of a bitch! Well, whatever. Diesel ain't gonna do shit except huff and puff a little. They're running. Not fast enough. I don't know. They're hauling ass. Ah, uh, no way they can outrun Sherry. She's a fucking puma. Uh, that's one tired-looking puma. She's usually faster. Oh, I can't watch this anymore. And they're liable to get away. Hand me my rifle. Shoot the dude. The girl will try to help him, and you'll be able to back her, too. Oh, what a bitch. She just left him there. Yeah, I feel a little bad for this guy. First he gets shot and he gets fucking backstabbed. I don't think we can carry anymore. Not even these meds. The box don't weigh much. The weight isn't the issue, it's just too much stuff. Are you sure about leaving this shit? I don't want to, but it's just asthma medication. I doubt there's a lot of asthmatics around anymore. Wait, I got an idea. Call Jay over here. What for? I'm betting he can rig this box so it'll blow the fuck out of anyone who tries to pick it up. Oh, that's cold. Hey, Jay! Come over here a minute! meeting because we all have a common enemy. The true sons are gaining a foothold in this city, and the more we fight amongst ourselves, the worse it's gonna get. I ain't afraid of those bitches, and I don't need some punk-ass motherfucker telling me what my crew can and can't do. I'm not trying to lay down the law, but if we don't find common ground, we will get wiped off the map. Then what do you suggest? We form a council. You have a problem? You leave your piece at the door, and we deal with it together, as an organization. What is this shit? It's called politics. So you mean like a treaty? Like a treaty. How you run your crew is your business. I'm game. Fuck it, I'm down. And? Fine. It's settled, then. Gather around, you bags of shit! It's time to hit the books. Okay, to make spice, all you need to do is spray the plants, get them all nice and moist, then spread them out on a table to dry. Quiet down! Fuck this up and the boss will have your nuts in a meat grinder! When they feel firm to the touch, take them over to packaging to get blinged up. Easy peasy. What did I tell you? This ain't high school. Misbehave in my classroom and you don't get detention, you get ballistic therapy. We've hit pay dirt, fellas. Delivery from our secret admirers. It's about time. I need an upgrade. So why do you think they're giving us all this shit? Because they know we the baddest motherfuckers in D.C. Give me that nine. Hey, 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 look, look, look. This one's got buttons and shit. That's one BFG. Those true sons ain't gonna know what hit them. We going post. 
busted on those jackasses. Hell yeah. Got no time for all this politics bullshit. If I wanted that kind of life, I would have gone to college. Something funny? You? College? Doesn't quite add up. Fuck you! We got a lot of dead wood on this council. What are you saying? I'm saying that they won't go down easy. I got no problems pulling the trigger. And that's exactly why college doesn't suit you. You're too emotional. Sometimes you gotta exercise restraint. Assess the situation. If we do this, there will be repercussions, and we need to prepare for which way shit's gonna fall out. If we want to survive, all this infighting needs to stop. <laughs> sure. That's totally achievable. Yeah, it better fucking be, because we can't be true sons in a straight-up fight. We don't have the training or the discipline, so we have to be smarter than them. And fucking each other over at every opportunity isn't smart. Depends whether you end up giving or receiving. That's like arguing who gets the penthouse when the whole building's about to burn down. Motherfucker, look around. Everything is burning down. All of it. If there's a chance you can get yourself a view from the top, why wouldn't you try? Because there's an option not to die in a fucking fire. If we stop acting like it's too late to do anything, we could actually accomplish something. I say we tie this motherfucker to a noose. Let's show the world what happens when they fuck with hyenas. Good job, fellas. So... It's true. When I was told they recovered the President of the United States, I almost didn't believe it. Needed to see it for myself. You seem awfully calm, considering your predicament. I'm in politics. I've been around enough liars and crooks to know when to be scared. Careful, Mr. President. In here, you've got no power. You're nothing but currency. What are you going to do with me? Nothing. For now. But you should make yourself comfortable. <laughs> 